Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to quickly diagnose a snowblower that isn't blowing snow. Here I've got a Craftsman snowblower. It's actually made by Murray. And as I've mentioned, this blower is not blowing snow. So what you want to do first is check the auger lever over here. So what you want to do is put it down. If you feel any resistance, that's good. You should. You want to make sure the cable's in good condition going to the linkage down here. You also want to remove the belt cover. There's two bolts holding it on and one on each side and it's usually a 3 8 or 10 millimeter head. And once you pull the cover off, you're going to see both belts. Now the auger belt is usually the belt in the front. It's the larger belt. This is the drive belt, so we don't need to worry about that belt today. Now what I've done before continuing is I've disconnected the spark plug boot. Right over here, as you can see, it's off the spark plug. This is for safety reasons. Now what I've done is put a tie wrap with the lever down. Now I'm going to pull the engine over and what you want to see is the belt actually turning, specifically the auger belt here. And it's imperative that the auger pulley here turns as well. So far what I've done is eliminated the doubt that it could be the cable, that it might be the belt or the linkages. So up to here, I know that everything's good on the blower. Now what you want to do is examine the rest of the blower here, which would include the impeller and the augers over here. So we know that the auger pulley is turning. Now I'm going to look inside here and show you the impeller. And here's the impeller. The next thing I'm going to do now is turn over the engine again. I'm going to leave the camera here to show you what happens when I turn the engine over. Now as you saw, the impeller turns when I turn over the engine and that's what you want to see. So the only thing left that could be causing the problem is this over here. So basically if you see the impeller turning and the shaft here and these aren't turning, the problem's in here. Most problems caused inside the gearbox are due to hitting something hard like a piece of wood or rock inside the augers and not having the proper shear pins installed. And in this case this is not the proper shear pin, it's actually a grade 5 or grade 8 bolt which is much harder than an actual shear pin. Shear pins are usually made of a grade 2 softer metal and will easily break if you hit something while blowing your driveway. And another lesson learned today is always make sure you've got the proper shear pins installed on your snowblower or you may end up causing damage inside the gearbox here. And if your blower is not the same as this one, they all work on the same principle so look at all the same components of your snowblower to diagnose it if it's not blowing snow. So thanks for watching guys, make sure to subscribe and you can see me in my next video. Have a nice day.